Hello again, it's Lock Noob, and in front of you, you see two Quint Wave Rakes from Law Lock Tools. These are the Echo Wave Rakes, and they look pretty nice if you ask me. Now, these are Quint Waves, because there are five peaks, and the top one, I believe, is the Cycloid Wave, and the bottom one is a Sinusoidal Wave. If you think that they look kind of familiar, that's because they are based off... Um, Christina Palmer's original designs uh, and you can buy them I think from Tool as well as the Wicked Waves. Now I want to show you these in action while I talk about them so you can see the types of locks that they can open and I'll show you the key bittings as well just so you can see that it isn't just uh, locks with flat bittings that these work on. So while those videos play I shall read this. Our brand new pair of rakes have been making waves on social media ever since I posted an image of the first pair. These profiles are based on Christina Palmer's original Quint cycloid and Quint sinusoidal waves, modelled by Christina and a group of PhDs using advanced mathematical software to create an awesome tapered wave effect. Christina is an amazing individual with a real passion for lock sport and the advanced physics that went into designing these two incredible profiles. The handles are based on an idea I had years ago and I thought now is the time to show these off to the world. They have a unique appearance with a grip feature on the face resembling the echo of a radar pulse. Not just nice to look at, but it provides a really positive grip. Also on both sides are small soft serrations to provide extra grip. Straight away, in initial testing, I personally had one to two second openings on several padlocks they really are that good. They also work really well with a slight rocking motion too. And again, pop locks open in seconds. The Law Lock Tools Echo Wave Brakes are produced in an incredibly strong 25 thousandths of an inch high yield 301 stainless steel with a yield strength of 20, oh, 291,000 PSI. There you go. So what do I think about these rakes now that I've used them well I hadn't used any of these um, quint wave rakes before I had the law lock tool ones and I have to say that uh, yeah they're brilliant actually I really like them in fact and this is a very rare event they are going to go into my own personal kit um, along with some of my other favorite wave rakes um, I genuinely think they are extremely useful and I've had a lot of fun playing with them. Um, they will actually stay in this kit and if you ever see me around or see this kit in videos you'll probably still see them in there. Um, I genuinely mean that they will be in my kit for the time being. I think they are really good and uh, they, they are a really nice wave rake so um, well done to Law Lock Tools and Christina Palmer for that design, it really does work. What do I think to the handle designs? I oh, just really like them. Law Lock Tools do a really nice extra length handle, which is good in my hands. I don't have like massive hands, but they're big enough that sometimes it gets annoying when a pick handle kind of flaps around in the palm of your hand as opposed to resting on the crook between your um, thumb and first finger. So I do like that. The Echo design is really cool. Um, the, the little grip here, um, actually, it does actually work, I find. It does help purchase that uh, in your fingers. So comp the outer edge and the inner sort of echo pattern actually just really works to provide some nice grip. Yeah, it's comfortable to use, well-rounded. And actually, the pair of these, excluding tax and delivery, depending on where you are in the world, comes in at only £8, which I think is... Absolutely brilliant, actually, really good value for such good quality picks. So there you go, those are the Echo rakes from Lolock Tools. I really enjoyed them. If you have it, if you actually have them yourself, could you let me know in the comments? What do you think of them? Are they good? How do they stack up uh, amongst the other wave rakes? Let me know. All right, hope you enjoyed that, and I'll see you all next time.